good morning good afternoon and good evening so today i got galaxy a51 and uh, today i am going to flash the latest release the ported rom of the one ui 6.1.1 on galaxy a51 so according to the description this rom is supported from the galaxy s23 fe according to the description that this rom is actually one ui 6.1.1 well if you can see the interface of the settings we are getting galaxy ai feature over here yes this option or this feature on the settings screen usually come with the one ui 6.1.1 this galaxy ai will not come with the one ui 6.1 but if i go further to about phone and then if i tap on software information so after flashing the rom on the galaxy a51 you will see that this is actually one ui version 6.1 and white 14 and the build number is this one xrom version 10.5 according to the developer the xrom 10.5 version is actually one ui 6.1.1 now doesn't matter if it shows one ui 6.1 but the features that coming with the one ui 6.1.1 also coming with this ported rom so basically galaxy a51 will get all the galaxy ai features that usually comes with the flagship mobile phone of the s series so all the latest features of galaxy ai coming with the ported rom on galaxy a51 just imagine that the old device galaxy a51 will also get galaxy ai features features that comes with the latest flagship mobile phone so starting the procedure do not forget to like the video if you are getting help from my videos then do, do not forget to subscribe my channel click or tap the bell icon click or tap the select all thank you first of all you need to check the mobile phone battery must be charged around like 30 to 40 percent so the mobile phone will get the rom easily and to save all the internal storage data because the fl flashing of custom rom will format everything you need to unlock the bootloader my mobile phone bootloader is already unlocked if you want to know how to unlock the bootloader i will provide the tutorial video link in my video description you can watch that video unlock the bootloader first then you can come and flash the rom on your mobile phone obviously your mobile phone must be updated to the latest stock firmware in case if your mobile phone once updated to the latest stock firmware and you are having any custom rom then doesn't matter but those who are having old stock firmware they need to update the mobile phone first then you can flash the customized rom the ported rom and other thing is you need to go to lock screen and uh, turn off the lock screen by selecting the swipe and then go to accounts backup manage accounts if you are having samsung account sync your samsung account once and then remove it same way sync your google account once and then remove it power of the mobile phone here is my downloaded folder i have uh, downloaded all the files that are required for flashing this is the ported rom file x rom ported from the galaxy s23 fan edition fe and the version currently is 10.5 for the galaxy a51 and we need to download odin 3.14.1 twrp current version is 3.7.1 and vb meter tar file informing you that all the links are provided in my video description just make a new folder and click the links download all the files and then first extract the odin 3.14.1 then open the extracted folder double click the Odin file click OK on this window and then on Odin click any slot I will click on AP then I will go to my downloaded folder and I will select the TWRP file by double clicking on it then I will click on CP I will go to my downloaded folder and I will click the VB Meta tar file by double clicking on it now coming back towards the mobile phone mobile phone is supposed to be power off and uh, bootloader must be unlocked now we need to boot the mobile phone into ordin mode now 
यू नीड टू प्रेस एंड होल्ड दी वॉल्यूम अप की वॉल्यूम डाउन की बोथ की एट सेम टाइम देन कनेक्ट द केबल विद द मोबाइल फोन एंड चेक द अदर साइड ऑफ द केबल मस्ट बी कनेक्टेड विद कंप्यूटर रिलीज द बोथ कीज व्हेन यू सी दिस वार्निंग स्क्रीन ना ऑन दिस स्क्रीन इफ यू सी दैट वॉल्यूम अप लॉन्ग प्रेस फॉर डिवाइस अनलॉक मोड दो हु नो दैट हाउ टू अनलॉक द बूट लोडर यू कैन अनलॉक द बूट लोडर फ्राम हेयर बाई प्रेसिंग द वॉल्यूम अप की फॉर इट इन लॉन्ग टाइम सो द अदर विंडो विल कम एंड देन यू कैन फॉलो वट एवर इट आस्क यू राइट नाउ द माई मोबाइल फोन इज करेंटली हैविंग एन अनलॉक बूट लोडर सो आई विल प्रेस द वॉल्यूम अप की वंस टू बूट इन टू ऑर्डिन मोड नाउ लेट मी शो द ऑर्डिन मोड स्क्रीन ऑफ माई मोबाइल फोन माई मोबाइल फोन मॉडल नंबर इज A five one five F current binary is custom. I was having six one UI six point one ROM and uh, FRP lock must be off. OEM lock must be off. In the brackets you can see which means that boot loader is already unlocked. Mobile phone boot it into Odin mode. Connected already with the computer. Coming back towards the computer screen, Odin must be detected the mobile phone. Here you can see that. Go on options and tick the auto reboot. Go back to lock, then click on start. Start it. Recovery flashing done. You can see the pass message. Click reset. Click exit. Go back to downloaded folder, and coming back towards the mobile phone screen. Now mobile phone is supposed to be booting into Odin mode currently because I untick the auto reboot. Now the cable must be connected. do not disconnect the cable we need to boot that uh, mobile phone into twrp from the ordin mode press and hold the volume up key volume down key and power key three keys at same time when mobile phone reboots then release the volume down key first okay release the power key when you see samsung logo do not release the volume up key until you see twrp screen and release the volume up key when you see team win recovery definitely the internal storage will get appears on your computer screen double click the internal storage to see that the folders are in proper name yes i can see that all the folders having proper names that can be read right which means that the storage is decrypt not encrypt we can copy paste go to the downloaded folder copy the rom file from there and then go to your internal storage of your mobile phone paste the rom file on your internal storage of the mobile phone so we got the rom file on the internal storage and uh, i am done from the computer and we can disconnect the cable from the mobile phone press the power key then uh, swipe to unlock the screen then tap wipe tap advanced wipe select dalvik cache metadata data then swipe to wipe when done then go back go back to main screen tab install scroll down select the rom file by tapping on it and then swipe to start flashing now check because the aroma file manager will get open tap next then tap here i agree with these terms and condition if you want to read then tap next If you want you can read the change logs that coming with the current version the latest one then tap next installation will begin after you press okay okay i will tap okay and the flashing will get started and it will take a little time so we have to wait now while flashing turn tap next to continue and then swipe to unlock and then we have to go back to main screen and then tap wipe tap format data type y e s then tap here and when done then tap reboot system well the mobile phone will take a long time staying on the samsung logo and then finally it will start to booting so the first boot will take a little time so we have to wait so first boot completed didn't took that much time complete the setup screen very smooth things went very well and uh, new wallpaper 
many features that we will get with the rom we'll go to settings now you can see that galaxy ai feature is available here in case if you are having one ui 6.1 you will not see this galaxy ai features here on the main settings screen we got the baseband also the google play system update you can see that first june 2024 connect the internet and check the update if the update is available this google play system will get update also so friends things went very well very smooth i got latest ported rom on my galaxy a51 and i got latest galaxy ai features on the galaxy a51 and also if you want to know about the rom about the bugs what are the things working or not working or what are the things that uh, has been fixed or what are the things that coming with the rom read the video description do not forget to like the video we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye